Hey there, everybody. Mario Fan 110 here, back with more Mario Kart 64. Let's get started. Alright, uh... Did it just do the glitch again? I actually managed to do it again. What the hell? Okay, let's just go. Yes, welcome. I honestly can't believe that happened, like, twice in a row. Okay, hold on. Let me just get my set up, like I said. I think I said it. Okay. Uh, there we go. Sorry about that, guys. Have a bit of juice left, so let's finish this off. Uh, here we go. Uh, drinking out of my Mario Kart thermos. Fuck yeah. Um, but yes, we will pick a one-player game. Oh, wait, actually, you know what I find actually interesting? Look at the four-player game icon. Super Mario 3D World much? <laughs> yep, it finally happened. Uh, you know what? Let's... Hmm, I don't know who to pick, actually. Uh... How about Toad? <laughs> yeah, let's make it like Super Mario Kart, shall we? Alright. Let's go to the Flower Cup, people. Toad's Turnpike. This was definitely a childhood favorite. And what do you know? It's... Uh, I keep on forgetting. What do you know? It's actually coming back in Mario Kart 8. Finally. Like, you're freaking... Mario Kart DS is the first Mario Kart, uh, Mario Kart game to introduce the whole Retro Cup concept. And... Oh my gosh, yay! Toad's Turnpike, and, and, and I'm Toad. I, I wasn't planning on that. That was hilarious. But yeah, Mario Kart DS was the first Mario Kart game to introduce Retro Cups. Or Retro Courses, rather. And, uh, yeah. It took until 2014. It took until the 8th game to have this course again. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna take all those. Well, actually, there's one that I didn't get. There you go. Both of you can just back off. And oh my god, this music is... I don't know if it's weird to say this, but the music is more nostalgic than the course itself. And actually, I, rem I remember playing this uh, this course with Kabuto when I was over at his place. And uh, oh my gosh, it's been... It's been three months since I've been over there. Which is, or actually four months. That, that, uh, that's what I meant to say. Holy crap, I thought that shell would have rebounded. Uh, uh, oh my god. I hope to get the, uh, to get the golden mushroom sometime because that's just flat out hilarious. But what's not hilarious is getting hit and you're flat. Oh god. Yeah, of course that'd be from Donkey Kong. Of course. And I took all those. Hee hee hee. Oh! Yeah, back to you, bitch. Oh my god. It's so weird to see these characters, like, looking like a, like, they came from a cutout. Oh, jeez. Well, this ain't no Super Mario Kart, so at least they're fair with the items. Thank goodness for that. And yeah, um, with these vehicles on the road, you can actually drive up them, like, as in ramps, and you can do tricks off them and uh, use the glider. So, huh, that's a genius way to use this. Uh, to use this course. Oh, nice. And, um... Uh, what was I gonna say? Darn it. I was gonna say something. Well, what was it gonna be? Take that. Take that! <laughs> oh yeah, Toad says that too, doesn't he? No, wait, that's someone else. Who says take that in this game? Shoot, I'm trying to remember. I, I don't think it's Toad. But yeah, these characters look like they came from a cardboard cutout. It's just so weird to see that. Oh my god, they look so bad. But it's Nintendo 64. What, like... Right? Like, what do you expect, I guess? Okay, one more, um... Lap left. Oh, shoot, I was gonna shoot it back. Uh-oh, no, stay back! Your name wasn't. Or your name isn't Toadstool in this game. It's Peach. Cause I don't know. Like, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think Super Mario 64 is the first game to actually have her name, like Princess Peach. Jeez, if that game didn't innovate enough. And 
I'm the best. I, you know, I used to play Toad in this game a lot. Which character do you guys play as in your childhood? Oh, God. Ugh! Vehicles in my face. Yeah, what was your favorite character to use in your childhood when playing this game? If you have any, like, any memories of it at all. Oh, Frappe Snowland. I think that's how you pronounce it. Or Frappe. Frappe. Well, if this course didn't come back, at least its music did. Hmm. Yeah, I love this place too. Except for those damn snowmen. Let's see, yeah, you can do tricks off that and all that stuff. Hey, look, it's Mario. Kind of reminds me of Snowman Land. That place was just irritating. Oh yeah, and I think we were doing that part when I was at Kabuto's house as well. That level. When the snowman blew you off and you lost your hat. And apparently there, apparently there was some kind of a glitch where you could do that over and over again and you would see like a dozen hats in the area. Like that was... <sighs> That's some funny stuff, I gotta say. And um, weird thing to talk about, but I guess I might as well mention it to you guys. Like. I don't know, just because. Um, I have nine Wii remotes, and I guess it's somewhat relevant because it's Nintendo and I'm playing this game on the Wii, and I can't believe I didn't have this game on my Wii. So it's like, hey, I don't have to buy it for capturing and all that stuff, because I can't capture 64 games, so I'll do it via the Wii. Um, so I guess it's, you know, related. Um, but yeah, I have nine remotes. And um, six of them are Motion Plus, and the other three are just normal. Nice. So I have four remotes for the Wii U. Um, I have Mario and Luigi. Yes, I actually did open those remotes from Christmas. So yeah, I have Mario and Luigi, um, a black Wii remote that has the sync button on the back as well, so it's like it came in Wii U packaging. And I have the um, Zelda Skyward Sword remote. So I have all four of these connected to the Wii U. And I have just like a regular red remote and a black remote without the sync button. Because like, what's the point of using two reds on a Wii U? Um, so because I did this, I have four remotes for the Wii U and I have four remotes for the Wii. So because of that, I don't have to sync anymore. Like, I, I don't have to press the sync button. And there you go. That course is done. Yay! Oh, I used to sing that when I was younger, but I failed. Um, yeah. I used to sing the chime when I was younger, but that's when my voice wasn't strained to shit. <sighs> of course, I'm not a teenager. I'm, I'm an adult. Oh, Choco Mountain. Oh, my God. I used to be like, what, is this chocolate? And are those coffee beans on the left? <laughs> look at that, they look like coffee beans there. They really do. Oh, this song. This song, jeez. I don't know if I'm like remembering it correctly, but I used to play battle mode in this game all the freaking time. And I remember hearing this music for battle mode. I don't know if I'm going crazy, but I'm trying to remember. Take that. Battle mode took up all my time with this game. I swear it just it does. Or it did, rather. Battle mode was just insane. Who else had their time eaten up in battle mode in this game? Because it did me. Get, get back, donkey. Cock. Oh, shit. Yeah! Perfect. You landed right on it. That's awesome. You know what's weird? I haven't finished Tropical Freeze yet. I still haven't. Oh, there you go. Two bananas. Oh my god. In Mario Kart Wii, that I play all the time with my girlfriend and my uncle, I just lay banana after banana after banana. And then they're like, huh, I wonder where these bananas came from. Holy shit. There's a lot of bananas. Um, I seriously should consider being Donkey Kong in like Mario Kart Wii if I play it all the time. Maybe in 8 I should too! What the hell? Oh my god, they look weird when they turn around. Okay. Yeah, I always time it right. Like, in Mario Kart Wii, when you're first place, 
um, there's a chance that you can get triple bananas, and like 99% of the time, I always time it exactly to get three bananas. So every time I got a question block, I always get three bananas, like just about. And people get irritated with me, and it's hilarious. Yeah, so that's how it is. And, oh, that's a shell this time. Oh, crap! I'm about to get my comeuppance. Oh my god, I didn't even drive for like a full two seconds. Jesus! Oh my god, they have three holes. Those bowling balls. Okay, come on! Oh, she got hit too. By a banana? Jeez. Is this rubber band AI or something? God, I hate that. Come on. That's right. Oh no! No, 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 don't run over me! Oh god, go, 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 go! Yes! I hate getting squished. Okay, so that's done. Alright, we got one more, uh, one more course left. 11 minutes recording, exactly. <laughs> when I checked it, that's kind of weird. Choco Mountain. Yeah, I didn't have too many memories with it. Oh, this course! It's in Mario Kart Wii, so there you go. I guess that counts for memories. Oh, you bitch. Whatever. On one of them, I did a perfect boost. So... Actually, what's that called? The initial boost for the 3, 2, 1 countdown. Oh my god. Sorry, it's been an age since I've played this on N64. So it's weird seeing it now. And I always comment that the map looks like an upside down horsey. But anyways. Oh, oh you can't go up there. No. Mario Kart Wii, you can. So that's why I'm confused. Oh my god, that was fast. 41 seconds? Jeez. Shoot, I was gonna say something. Oh my god, that looked weird. Uh, yeah, the map is a upside down horsey. It is. Oh, damn it. Stay back. The grass looks weird. Everything does. You know what? I'm gonna try and do a trick here. Yeah! No. Okay, let's get that. Oh yeah, I was in this course. And I got squished. When I was playing with him. Shoot, I was gonna say something. But it's, it's just escaping my head. I doubt I'm gonna remember it. Unfortunately. Let's see, I mentioned Triple Bananas. I've mentioned... Mario Kart Wii and everything. Oh, that's so irritating. I can't remember. I can't do it. Mario Raceway. Alright, well, I guess we're done anyway. It doesn't really matter. It's fine. Oh, jeez. Oh! Stay back, you. Wish I could look behind me. I don't think you can in this game. Alright, well, that's it. We're done the Flower Cup. Got first on all of them. That's right. Alright, well, I guess that's it for this video. Hmm. That commentary was pretty darn good. Okay. Purple Sky, Fireworks, Mario 64 Castle, it's all here. Shut up, TV. Bitch. Well, hey, at least Peach made it to the podium. That's cool. And Donkey Kong. Yeah, we got Toad. Toad helps you with the stars. You know, secret stars. Peach, this is her fucking castle. And Donkey Kong... Nope. Absolutely nothing. No correlation. None. And there's the trophy. Well, guys... See you next time in the Star Cup of Mario Kart 64. See you then.